all you heat seekers out there. Welcome back to Fat and Spicy. I'm Fat. And I'm Spicy. Mini, mini Reaper. Yeah, the <laughs> Mini Reaper is back. This is the channel that's dedicated to everything with flavor and spice. And not, and not so, so nice. nice. <laughs> Woohoo! All right, guys, we're back today with a hot sauce review. And today we got this, uh, this interesting hot sauce right here in Wendell, North Carolina from the general store. It is a moonshine hot sauce. Uh, we've tried, I don't know if we actually, I don't know if we've tried anything like this before. Uh, no, just that moonshine banana pudding. We've mixed Old Smoky Moonshine with a hot sauce, or we took a shot of it right after a hot sauce, but we have not had one made with moonshine. And so the ingredients on this are vinegar, pineapple juice, garlic powder, moonshine whiskey, pepper extract, and some red Savina habaneros. So... It sounds like it could be pretty hot. I don't know how hard the the flavor from like the whiskey moonshine is gonna hit, but I mean that's what we're here for. We're here to find out. All right. As always around here, we're gonna give this a sniff test to see what we're getting into. Yeah, me too, Audrey. You gonna smell it? So actually, so far it smells pretty good. It smells like pepper. Yeah, it definitely smells. <laughs> yeah. You smell the vinegar and you smell pepper. The pineapple isn't coming through super strong in the scent. It's weird. It smells like a. Let's go one more time. Like, and I forget what it is. Like a cucumber salad is what I smell. Yeah, that's what it tastes like. Yeah, it smells very like Mediterranean, actually, which is very odd. It does not seem like it would, but I mean, that's. I think we're getting Mediterranean from the local general store. Yeah, that's the smell that we're picking up. So maybe it's just that vinegar. I'm not sure. Yeah. We're going to try today's hot sauce on these wings. From Publix. From Publix. And, and the Mini Reaper here is going to try something else. What are you trying? Can you pull that out? Are they spicy? Are they going to be spicy? Uh -huh. It's he's, a Takes Fuego. Yep, he's going to try some Fuego uh, Taki since not only is this, you know, probably a fairly hot hot sauce, but. I mean, it does have moonshine whiskey in it, so I don't know. I, I doubt it's enough to actually. Yeah, and I go and try different chips on this video too. Hot, I want to. It's a very okay. So first off, I just want to say it's a very weird color. I don't know what they're pulling the color from. I mean, unless it's just the pineapple, maybe the moonshine just killed all the color of it. It is like a white. Yeah. Yeah, it just, I don't know. It's a, it's a white, like thick, cloudy liquid. It's, it's very odd, but it's also like very, it looks very runny. Well, actually more than runny, it's like syrupy. It kind of like is slightly okay. congealed. It's. Oh yeah, that looks here. Like, like hot. Watch as I like pour it for hot. It's a little. I was going to say, you know, it's, it's a, it's a family show, but this is jacked up. That's a little weird. Yeah. We'll see. Definitely, I do not want to taste this ever. So we'll go ahead and try our wings. Get your chip ready, Mini Reaper. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Hold on. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> mm. Wow, that's potent. Yeah. That did that tastes like a cucumber salad in a bottle. That's like really strong vinegar. Oh yeah. Yep. Mm. Oh, that that is weird. <laughs> we have tried. We have over. That's fresh. That right burned my tongue. <laughs> it was... Is that hot? Yeah. Yeah, you can finish it though. Yeah, yeah I'm trying to finish it. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> You can finish it. <laughs> Did you get enough? Yes. That All take right. a little hot? Sit, yeah. sit there. But they're going to eat more chips, right? All right, yep. I'm going to set this to the side. All right, back to the sauce. We've done over 300 videos on this channel. And it's crazy that we still come across sauces that have a totally unique flavor. <laughs> you need some more? Yeah. So that's pretty hot, isn't it? Yeah. But you like it? The mini reaper has met his match. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Um, 
It's, I mean, it's good. It's just odd. I mean, it's, uh, yeah, like, if you've ever been, again, to a Mediterranean place that has, like, a strong vinegary, like, coleslaw or, like, cucumber salad or something along those lines. That's, that's the taste I get. I mean, it's good. It's really not overwhelmingly hot or anything. It's actually a pretty good tasting sauce. It's just, like, I don't know. Something about it is is unique, but I, again, I think it's just that pineapple and that uh, that vinegar mix. So, so the the challenge of this is is what would we use this sauce on? Well, it feels like light and fresh. So, like I mean, grilled chicken is really good. It's not bad on these wings. I like yeah. it on the wings. Grilled chicken. It's, I was I was thinking like, along the lines of a and y'all can correct me. Send them all in. Gyro, hero, gyro, however you want to say it. Euro, yeah. I mean that's not a bad idea. That might be. Um, weirdly enough, I mean, kind of like you said. I mean, I might actually use this in like a coleslaw or you know something of that nature, like a potato salad. Well, not a potato salad, like a pasta salad or cucumber salad or I don't know, just something more light. But it's uh, it's a good sauce. I mean, I, I really. The only thing I would say about it is I wish I did get a little bit more of that sting from like the moonshine whiskey. That's not coming through super strong, but. Yeah, I'm I'm pretty surprised by it. And I don't even know who makes this. Again, it just says the Wendell General Store, and Wendell's a pretty small town, so I don't know if this is some local guy or, or where they got it from, but it's it's surprising. I don't know, for, for for mental capacity, I think I would add a little coloring to it. It's and it's kind of slimy. Like it, the consistency is weird. I don't know. <laughs> it's a weird sauce, guys. I don't know what to say. I mean, luckily, like I said, there's not like I don't see a specific sauce company attached to this. So, I mean, I don't feel too bad like roasting it a little bit. But it's a weird sauce. I mean, again, the flavor is not bad, but I mean, just a I don't know weird idea, weird color, weird texture. Just a lot of weirdness to it. So that's the sauce from real local to us. I mean, here in Wendell, North Carolina. And uh, yeah, I mean, I don't have any complaints about it. It's, it's a good sauce, surprisingly. With all that being said, remember to keep it fat. And keep it spicy. See ya! See ya!